my name is Hannah and today we are going to make the I'm going to show you how to make it the bridge style bracelet um for this you will need to have your loom so that the arrow is pointing away from you and so that the middle row is coming up to you and da and in at the other side like this for this you will need two white bands 20 black bands, 8 of your own choice, another 8 of your own choice, and another 8 of your cho own choice. I'm going to use pink, blue and purple, but you can use whatever you want. off you will need to get your two white bands and put it on your middle middle hook at the front then pull it out to this side and put it on that hook then put the, it on the middle hook again but instead put it out to that side so it'll look like this like this okay then you get your black bands Get your first black band and put it on this side going upwards in a straight line. So it will look like this. Then get another one and put it on the, that hook, a pit thing, and bring it up. And continue doing this until you're two notches from the end. If you want, you can pause the video here until you've got up to the end. Now, when you are two notches from the end, finish your thing finish your row and go over to the other side. Do the exact same thing on the other side of your loom. When you're done, it, will, it should look a bit like this. Okay. Now, get your first of your eight, two of your eight of your own choice bands, I'm using pink, and put them on the middle hook and bring it upwards. Then get the same colour and get two of them and bring them upwards again. And do this um, until you've gone to the end of your loom. Then after you've done your first colour, go on to your second colour and then go on to your third colour.
Make sure your bands aren't, um, aren't knotted into each other. Okay, next we will do the hooking process. You have to turn your loom around so that the arrow is pointing away from you. You start with your your um start with your middle ba band in this one. Pick it up, pick up the bottom one and bring it out to the side. So it can look like this. There. Then do the same with the other one. Bring it up and bring it out to the side. Then get your next, get your black band on the end and bring it up and bring it, bring it, just leave it the last one there and bring the next one up and over. Okay, just do that on both sides. Then do the same in your middle, go back to your middle and do the same thing. Get your bottom one, bring it out to the side, get your next one and bring it out to the side. Then get the next of your coloured ones, pick it up and bring it out to the side. Do the same then, pick it up and bring it out to the side. Do this until you reach the end of your loom. You'll get this teardrop. You'll get a teardrop shape if you hook if you hook the right band. For the last one, just leave the, it the way it is. Then come back to the start and hook hook your black bands just onto each other. So just take this the bottom one, bring it up and put it on the top. Make sure you push it down on the loom when you're doing it. When you come to your white band, just bring it up and bring it into the center. Do the same on the other side.
then then get just leave that one there. Okay. Now your hooking process is finished. It should look kind of like this. Okay? Now, what you're going to do now is get the end, get your, get the end one where the white is going over and put your, put your hook through, through it and out the side and make sure all the bands are on it. And then get another band of your choice, white is probably a good idea, and pull it through and over and put it on to your thing. Then get an S clip or a C clip, whatever you have, and put it on to the end. Okay. Then take everything off simply by pulling it over your loop. Thank you for watching. So hopefully tomorrow I'm going to make something else and if you want me, whatever you want me to make, you can put it in the comment box.